Love me, love my birthmark. Professional dancer, 22, refuses cosmetic surgery and says she is proud of the way she looks. A professional dancer has refused to have plastic surgery to remove her birthmark, as she has chosen to embrace her individuality. Cassandra Nod, 22, says she loves her unique appearance and even credits her birthmark for making her memorable in her industry. The dancer, from Alberta, Canada, who was once told by a casting agent to digitally erase her birthmark from her headshots, says that she believes it is a positive attribute. My birthmark is a huge part of me, she says. It makes me unique and memorable, which is especially important for the career I've chosen. When Cassandra was born with a huge brown birthmark on her right cheek, her parents, Richard, 60, a power engineer, and France, 50, a school caretaker, were given the option to have it removed, but concerned that it would leave her face heavily scarred, they decided against it. Cassandra says she is happy with the decision that her parents made, as the effects of surgery could have been extremely damaging. As my birthmark sunk through several layers of skin, plastic surgery was the only option for removal. Doctors gave my parents a choice, warning them there could be scarring or I could be left with a lazy eye, she says. I am so glad my parents chose to leave my birthmark, as it's part of who I am. Having a birthmark distinguishes me and I don't feel that it has ever held me back with her envious dancer body and gorgeous smile. Cassandra is used to attracting attention from strangers, but she says people are often very curious when they notice her birthmark. People come up to me in the street and ask me about it. I don't shy away from questions it's natural to be curious. It's covered in hair which makes it difficult to disguise, but I honestly don't mind. I know some people might feel sorry for me, but I'm confident in how I look. Cassandra hasn't always been so confident, as during her school years, she was the victim of cruel taunts from bullies. She says, they taunt me saying, you'll get beat up in high school and the hair on your cheek is gross. Their cruel remarks were hard to deal with and I'd often fight back tears. I felt ugly even if only for that moment and I was terrified of how I'd be treated once I got to high school after years of bullying. Cassandra was plagued by feelings of wanting to fit in and, aged 13, she gave her mom some shocking news. She says, I told my mom that I wanted to remove my birthmark. My parents were shocked but understanding of my decision and immediately booked an appointment with a plastic surgeon. He explained the scarring I'd be left with and I immediately changed my mind. I figured it wouldn't be worth it and told my mom that I'd prefer to keep my individuality. It was a moment of madness, but I'm so glad I made the decision to keep it after high school. Cassandra studied dance theater at the American Musical and Dramatic Academy in Los Angeles, California, where she starred in a production of musical, Cabaret. She graduated in July of 2014, and stayed in law, where she now works as a professional dancer, recently starring in a promotion for sports channel ESPN, which featured Maroon 5. Cassandra has also branched out into kids entertainment having also worked on popular kids channel, Nickelodeon. She says, a lot of roles require the performers to have a certain appearance. I'm never going to be hired by Disney, for example, because they want the perfect look but I'm okay with that. I don't often face prejudice, but one agent told me to photoshop my birthmark out of my head shots. Wanting to please. I agreed at first, despite feeling shocked they'd asked. But then I changed my mind Cassandra's birthmark has not stopped her from finding love, and is currently in a relationship with boyfriend Patrick Cook, 21, after meeting eight months ago in Los Angeles. Cassandra says, we met at an audition for a dancing role and we've been inseparable ever since. He always tells me I'm beautiful despite the unpredictable nature of the entertainment industry. Cassandra's parents have been supportive of her career. And now the dancer wants to urge other people to love themselves exactly as they are. She says, people should appreciate their individuality. Times are changing, so don't worry about looking normal.
Don't let bullies stop you and be proud of your uniqueness.